So Jordy, how was it to finally get back on the court and play up and down? It was amazing, man. It's been, I think, nearly 500 days since I played an NBL game. So there's, you know, finding my feet a little bit, but it was just great to be back out there playing with the boys. To that, how do you think you and the team played up and down? Oh, we, we learnt a lot. It was a great hit out, uh, three games, and I felt like we got better as we went on. So that's a that's a good sign. You know, it's not going to be the best basketball pl we play all year, but it's a, it was a good starting point. Which player stood out to you up and down with Nickens? Oh, which player? I, I'm going to go with my boy Iggy Mitchell, my roommate. He uh, he really took the court by storm when he was out there and showed us some of his bag of tricks. As a group, what were the key learnings you guys have sort of learned up and down and to try and bring back to training now? Just translating how hard we go at each other on on the training floor into into a game and trusting that process. The attention now shifts to defending the crown. Um, on Saturday we go down to Illawarra to take on the Hawks. Um, talk us through the, the rivalry there and how exciting to get back on the court for that. It's, uh, it's a great way to start the season. So you want to play you, you want to play those guys down the road to you know hit the ground running, and they're they're a great team, and we'll be ready to roll. What's the case to beating the Hawks on their home court? Well, it'll be just about us, you know, just making sure we take care of uh, our offense and defense and sticking to our guns, and that should uh, that should help us take care of business. Good luck down there. Thank you.